In this video, we will be taking you on a tour of the Thompson Main House as well as its sister property, the Thompson Beach House. We will also show you some activities and good places we ate at during our three night stay at Playa del Carmen. Make sure to hit like and subscribe to see more hotel tours such as this. Thompson Main House is an adults-only luxury boutique hotel located in the heart of bustling 5th Avenue in Playa del Carmen. As soon as I entered the lobby, I immediately knew I was at a Thompson property because of the distinct smell and decor all Thompson hotels have. We are at the Thompson Main House in Playa del Carmen. And let's check out our room 228, a king room with balcony. First, first, let's take a look at the bathroom. There's products here by Bow Makers, which all Thompson properties use that we've stayed at. Here's an oval mirror, two bottles of complimentary water each day. There's one of the robes, toilet, and the rainfall shower is here with full size bow maker products. There's also a handheld shower if you want to use that. Now let's look at the closets. There's two small closets here. So this one has the other robe and a couple of cabinets on the bottom. And here is the other closet, which has ironing board, iron, flashlight, and a couple more storage drawers at the bottom. And this bathroom has a sliding door. I don't know how much privacy you're going to get because it's see-through, so that's not going to help much. And there's this, I'm not sure what this is for, but I think it's where you hang your wet clothes what I think it is and let's see what they have here this is our welcome letter from Thompson and they provide earplugs because we're right on 5th Avenue where all the clubs and bars are so it gets really loud here let me show you this this is a sliding door which shows the shower but it has frosted glass so it's not see-through. Here's a king-size bed with a little sitting area in the front, a big screen TV. And it's Hyatt Globalist. They provided us with some welcome macarons. We'll look at that later. Here is the safe. And there's nothing in this drawer. This drawer below, this cabinet below has a fridge with some drinks and snacks for purchase. And that's the prices of the drinks and snacks. Some coffee, an espresso coffee maker, and another storage cabinet right there. There's a sofa here. You can fit up to three people sitting there. It's a pretty big sofa. And now let's check out the view. And here's the view of Fifth Avenue. So we have a, a sofa here and a table, a couple chairs. It's pretty loud because there's a club right above us on the rooftop. And this is actually a shopping mall. We're, we're on top of the shopping mall. And here's the view. The beach is two blocks down the street, so it's not far at all. And we're gonna go check out several of these restaurants while we're here. And look how nice this hotel is. And that is a quick tour of our room here at the Thompson Main House in Playa del Carmen.
the block long rooftop pool offers 360 degree views, live DJs, cabanas, and two on site restaurants. Hotel guests get free access to Alessia Day Club, which is open from 11 a.m. to 7 p.m. daily. The rooftop turns into Alessia Nightclub in the evening. The pool and bar area look very lively with all the LED lights transforming the space into a big party scene. However, no guests showed up during the evenings. Hey, I guess it was just a private pool party for the two of us. We were informed that Alessia Nightclub just started the previous night, so people don't really know about it yet. We had breakfast at Cinco, the hotel's adults only rooftop restaurant. Fruit plate with yogurt and granola to start. We ordered the omelette and spinach frittata. Breakfast here was just okay. It was included in our stay, so I can't really complain. We stopped by Umi Rooftop for some Japanese food for dinner. The open air restaurant has great views of the lively 5th Avenue below. The menu features mostly sushi dishes with some meat options. We ordered three different sushi rolls. Honestly, we were quite disappointed at how tiny the portions were. I was surprised to see a small gym at the hotel since there was no mention of it on the hotel website. It'll do the job, but who goes to Playa del Carmen to exercise? Um, that would be me. There are also bikes at the lobby if you want to be more active. Thompson Main House guests have access to its sister property, the Thompson Beach House, which was a short 5 minute walk away. Guests can enter through the main entrance on 8th Street, or enter the hotel through the beachfront entry. I really love this property since it's located directly on the beach. The hotel has set up chairs right on the sand, or you can use the sofa loungers right out front as well. If the beach is not your thing, you can lounge by the long, narrow pool with chairs or rent one of the cabanas. Make sure to stop by the pool bar for a complimentary tequila tasting for hotel guests daily at 6 p.m. It turned into a private tasting since we were the only ones at the bar. No complaints here. Okay, uh, your name, amigo? Ryan. Ryan? Definitely. Nice to meet you. Okay, the first tequila, Terradura Plata, tequila white, the sour dry, the stain, the boring, two months, okay? We survived all five rounds. If you like tequila, don't miss out on a free tasting. We had breakfast at the hotel's oceanfront restaurant, Sea Grill. Yogurt, granola, and fruits were served before the main entrees. We had the Eggs Benedict and Ranchero Eggs. Beverly tries to watch every Cirque du Soleil show that exists, so we made our way to watch Joya. It was a 25 minute taxi ride to get to this beautiful venue. Before the show started, we grabbed some food at Nectar, Grill and Lounge. Both of the shrimp and steak tacos were amazingly good. Our seats included appetizers and a bottle of champagne. The actors both spoke English and Spanish, so it was easy to understand the storyline. We really enjoyed the various acrobats which Cirque du Soleil is known for. My favorite was this guy spinning the cube. The show was good and we recommend watching it if you like Cirque du Soleil shows. We 
We also checked out Coco Bongo Show and Disco, which was right beside our hotel. We paid $86 each for regular open bar tickets. This seemed to be a popular spot because the line was extremely long. It was madness once we got inside. The show consisted of several acrobatic performances, as well as impersonators such as Queen featuring Freddie Mercury and the King of Pop Michael Jackson. This place was way too crowded and crazy for us, so we didn't stay long. On our first day, we had lunch at La Cueva del Chango, the Cave of the Monkey. The open-air restaurant serves Mexican food and is surrounded by vegetation and an abundance of trees. We ordered the grilled tuna fillet sandwich and grilled fish fillet. Both dishes were fantastic and we recommend checking out this place. There's so many places to eat here it gets a bit overwhelming. Luckily, we stumbled upon a small taco spot just one block away from 5th Avenue. La Antojeria is located in front of a small convenience store on 10th Avenue and 8th Street. They had a promo of 5 Pastor Tacos for 100 pesos. The tacos here were so good and you cannot beat it for the price. We actually ate here three times. Make sure to check it out when in Playa del Carmen. with beautiful modern rooms, a spectacular rooftop pool, direct access to the beach, and located right in the heart of 5th Avenue, the Thompson Main House was the perfect place for us to stay at Playa del Carmen. If you enjoyed this video, please give us a like and subscribe to our channel. Leave any questions in the comments section below. Thank you for watching and check out our other videos.